guys, I am gonna get ready right now because I got invited to go to a pretty little thing. Their little showroom, I think it is. I'm gonna show you a little bit of my week. LA Fashion Week is coming up and I'm gonna take you guys with me. This is what I'm wearing right now. An Aritzia top. These are Alpha Elite sweatpants. We're gonna change right now. Okay, y'all. This is the outfit. LA apparel, bodysuit, and then Jaded London pants. I'm wearing Versace shoes. My king. He's so excited. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Hello. I just got some stuff from Pretty Little Thing. My next plans are canceled, so I think I'm just gonna go home. I'm honestly feeling under the weather today. I like have this thing when people come over at my place and they stay over, I get attached to them. And then once they leave, I just feel so empty and sad for a few days. Like, I don't know why, I don't know what it is. It's probably some, I don't know, attachment issues I got from my childhood. <laughs> Oops, I just honked. <laughs> <laughs> My social anxiety levels are at an all-time high. Same. Psych, I'm vibing. I'm not. They're getting in. Maybe we're all Hey guys. Hey guys. This is Reagan. Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> hey, we like, just met. We, yeah. We're besties We're now. like this. Yes. There we go. We're about to get in a limo. <laughs> Wow. Okay guys, I just got home. I'm so freaking dead right now. I'm so tired and my hair looks like a mess. So I'm gonna go to bed. I forgot to film. We went to Boa after the screening, the whatever we went to. Probably gonna post a TikTok about it, but I did film it on my phone, so. Hello. You gonna run? Okay, well this is cute. Hey guys, it's Saturday. We're going to revise Denim's show. I'm getting ready right now. Honestly, I'm not really too happy about the way that I'm looking. I'm breaking out everywhere. My face, my skin just looks horrible horrible right now my forehead i never break on my forehead my chest my arms my back not as much but this really stresses me out because i was on accutane twice and i don't want to get acne again because that was like the worst thing in my life and i'm not gonna lie the past few weeks my eating habits my sleeping schedule everything has been so f up. Personally, like I don't know what is going on with me, why I'm feeling this way or acting this way. There's not a, something actively going on that's making me go through a depressive few weeks. I need to force myself to get back on track because this is not okay. I don't want to start breaking out again. Okay, so you guys know the famous setup that I always do. This is something I've never done. I'm going to show you all my skincare. What I usually do in the morning. I use this and then you press it down and let it come up a little bit. I mix it with this. A little bit. Just one pump. And then we got vitamin C. I also still shake it anyways. And then one pump. Mix it up. Then I use a brush. I brush my lashes first. I get lash extensions. Okay, and then I brush my eyebrows up. I don't usually put on an eyebrow gel or anything. I got my eyebrows laminated two months ago. I should probably get them done again. But it's a two hour drive and I'm not really feeling the two hour drive. But she's honestly the best that I drive two hours to go with her. Everyone's asking me for a hair routine so I'll make a video on that. I don't know if you guys want me to make a video on YouTube or TikTok about it or both. So let me know in the comments. I don't know what this is but my mom tells me to put this on my hair. So I'm putting this on my hair. We grab a little bit of this literally like... Sorry, I didn't mean to like, flip you off, but <laughs> just a little bit. You just keep frothing your hands together. I don't know if that's the right word of what I'm doing right now. I'm just straighten my hair just a little bit so I can like take the frizz out. I'm using Dyson straightener. My hair dryer is also Dyson, the air wrap. Okay, I'm back. I'm gonna wear my Versace shoes. They're my favorite shoes because they're just so comfortable and like, basic, but they're not Nike Air Force ones that everyone has. I always like being unique, and some people are gonna make fun of me for saying this, but I don't like to buy things that everybody has and like i really like putting on 
socks. I can't stretch because my hammies hurt. I worked out my hamstrings yesterday. I feel like I talk a lot of shit. I'm just nervous. Like, I know I'm just talking to the camera or to myself, but I'm really nervous doing this YouTube thing because I've never done it talking before. I used to do YouTube, but it was the same things that I do on my TikTok, just longer. Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> I don't know what to expect with YouTube. I just feel like you guys are going to be so disappointed when you watch my YouTube. Maybe the first one is just going to suck and I hopefully it'll get better with time. The thing is, I don't like watching people on YouTube personally because I have ADHD, so I already have like a really short attention span. The only person that I like to watch, and I barely even do, but if I do watch somebody's vlogs, it's David Dobrik because his are short and super entertaining. There's always something new happening every second, which is like good for me. I'm talking a lot here. I am so sorry. I'm going to show you the fit. This is the fit. I'm really short, so these are kind of long, so I had to tie them at the bottom. Pants, they're cut hockey green they're from jade at london and then the bodysuit is from opali but i got it a really long time ago so i don't think they have it anymore sweet boy he needs a bath he hates baths look at him he's so sweet he's 13 years old guys this man is so strong he's a strong soldier and he's healthy and happy king He's gonna get a little sister soon. The view. You usually see the Hollywood sign over there when it's not that foggy. <gasps> you can see it. Look, 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 look. And then this is the other side. So you got all of LA, kind of. He likes to sit in the sun. Hey guys, wait, is this the G7X? Yeah. I have this one. Really in my bag. Oh! <laughs> We're in line right now for revised denim, right? Waiting to get into the show. But it does. Hey guys, it is currently a Sunday morning. I got some packages in the mail, so I'm gonna go get them, do a little try on haul. Okay y'all, I'm back and right as I sit down on my floor, my chancla broke. Okay, alpha Lee. I got shorts. These are the will blue color. They look kind of the same as my navy ones, to be honest. Now we got the scarlet ones. I wanted these when they came out, but I think I just couldn't afford them at that time. This is titanium. It honestly looks like my French blue color. These colors are way too similar. I like their quality a lot. Okay, and then I got the wash denim color. These are pretty, I don't have this color. All right, so here we got the titanium color. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Like a dark gray. And obviously these are more blue, but I think they're just very similar in color. I'm a lover boy. She got a toy. These are the well blue color. I have the navy ones right here. Almost identical. Maybe wouldn't shade light or less blue. These are the wash denim color. I don't have any shorts that are light blue. I'm glad I got these. Be who you wanna be. We all stun up to like the eye. And then we got the scarlet one. I love this color personally. I have the formula red color, which is a really bright red. But I like these a lot more. I have no idea what the next few months of my life is going to look like. My life has changed so much since March. Since I took a break from school and I moved into this apartment. My life honestly did a 180. I always knew that I was going to be in the entertainment industry one way or another. Acting is what I want to do and what I'm going to do. But I just want to build up my social media for now. I think it's just crazy. As soon as I started posting my little vlogs, it just blew up like crazy. Like, I never expected this to happen. I need to go to Europe. I have to take advantage of the time that I have because I think after summer, I will not be able to leave the country anymore for five years. Yeah, I need to mentally prepare myself for that and just enjoy the time that I have. The thing is I start school next semester. I won't have as much free time as I have had for the past year. I don't even want to think about it right now, but that's a whole other story that I will maybe talk about someday, but not right now. My little guy right here. Hi. 
I am gonna cook bolognese and it takes two hours. So I'm bringing you guys with me. I'm not exactly gonna put step-by-step -step recipe because it is a secret mom recipe, but I'll show you guys a little bit of the process. I'm cutting up onions right now. I have this tool that is literally a lifesaver. I got it on Amazon. Cut your onion in half. You just put your onion in and Look at that, little tiny pieces, perfectly cut. This is the ground beef that I buy. Lara's lean beef. I know it's ironic, my name is Laura, but I swear to God, this is the only ground beef that I like. I hope Johnny right here. Now we're gonna liquefy our tomatoes. I boil my tomatoes. Okay, y'all, we're doing a taste test. <gasps> oh my god, that is so good. I wish you guys could try it. Wow, I'm not being biased because it's me. That was the best, and my friends will tell you that is the best pasta or bolognese sauce that you will ever try in your life. Thing is, my mom's Italian. Little life story. She was born in Sicily, in Italy. Her whole family is Italian, like 100%. Not like American Italian, just Italian. She's nothing to do with America. She's a chef, like she has her own restaurant in Aruba. So if you ever go to Aruba, DM me. I tell this to everyone. If you go to Aruba, DM me. I will literally give you the best tips and recommendations you will ever get. And my mom is the number one place you have to visit. My mom's restaurant. She's the chef. She's the owner and my brother works there too which is cute amazing yeah best food you will ever eat ever in your life trust me completely talked out my ass like <laughs> i feel like that was confusing i love you shy if you're watching this nobody come for me the fact that it's watery okay i like my bolognese watery that's just me okay personal preference Ooh. 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 <laughs> So today's Monday. He does not look amused. I'm gonna take you guys to the gym with me. So we have this top is from Crop Shop Boutique. Shorts are the new ones from Alpha Lee. And then my hat is Bun Dutch. I know I always wear the black one, but I have a denim one which matches with the shorts. And then my shoes are Nike vintage blazers. I broke out even more um, and I found out I'm breaking out because I'm taking vitamin B12 and I am supposed to take vitamin B12 because when I got my blood work done I had a deficiency in that I don't really want to take pre-workout because my favorite I have so many brands but my favorite is first form and I don't like the flavor that I have so okay before I buy anything ever I always read the reviews and everyone was going crazy about this one flavor so I got it and and it's not super bad, but it's just too sour for me. I don't like it. And I'm trying to get strawberry kiwi one. I really want to get that one, but it's sold out. It's been sold out forever. Um, this is really good. I'm eating a lani with protein bar. I usually hate protein bars because they feel so dry and heavy and weird. But this one's really good, so... I want to say I got the peanut butter cup flavor. I usually don't like peanut butter at all. I actually hate it. But this one's really good, so... We're gonna drink some Celsius. What's so funny to me is that when I first blew up, I was posting myself doing stupid stuff with Celsius in my hand. Now they're sending me a 12 pack every month for free, which is amazing because I love Celsius. Celsius, if you're watching this, I love you, you're my favorite. I'm like mentally preparing myself to go to the gym with an actual camera and talk to the camera because I am very scared. It's okay, it's all in my head. I just need to relax, it's all in my head. I don't know if I'm gonna film on my phone because then I'm gonna have two freaking tripods, two cameras. I feel like everyone's gonna be staring at me like, what is this girl doing? I shouldn't care, I shouldn't care, I shouldn't care. I'll see what I do. I'll meet you guys there. Okay, so I'm at the gym right now. I know it's like really loud. I'm getting really anxious, I'm not gonna lie. I was doing this one workout and I just stopped doing the workout because there were so many people around me. Right now, I'm gonna do leg extensions. I'm gonna do four sets of eight to ten and try to hold it at the end. Yeah. Hey. Feeling young, but they treat me like the OG. And they want to tea on me, I swear these bitches nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we go.
gon' see. I won't put no money on this shit. My niggas owe me. I got it. I got it with the shirt out, but that wasn't heavy at all. I did one plate. I think I'm gonna add a 25 pounds more. It's in a case, so you know it's me. Imitation isn't flattery, it's just annoying me. And I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil, and I grew up about it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. Big wheels keep rolling. I can do with a 45. Outside, 29, G5, C side. I've been losing friends and finding peace. But honestly, that sounds like a fair trade to me. If I ever heard one, then I'm still here. Outside, front line, south side. I've been losing friends and finding peace. Honestly, that sounds like a fair trade to me. Look, don't invite me over here if you throw another pretty party. Looking back, it's hard to tell you where I started. I don't know who loved me, but I know that it ain't everybody. Okay, now we're gonna do the leg press machine. I'm gonna start off with two plates. I can never love a she a busy body. Baby, if you want me, can't be turning up with everybody. Nah, can't be fucking on this anybody. Yeah, I got feelings for you, that's the thing about it. Yeah, you know that it's something when I sing about it. Yeah, mama used to be on disability, but gave me this ability. And now she walking with her head high and her back straight. I don't think you're feeling me, I'm out. Okay, so I'm gonna make it higher just because I'm trying to do it more really focused. Yeah, being everything they said I wouldn't be, it couldn't be. I don't know what happened to them guys that said they would be. I said, Okay, now I'm gonna do some Bulgarian split squats. I'm gonna do four sets of 12. Um, I usually put like a little setup over there. I don't go too high because I, I mean, I have a person that I would follow all the time when I was like doing, figuring stuff out on myself was JPG coaching on TikTok. And I don't remember the reason <laughs> behind it, but he said to do a lower. Thingy. So that's what I've been doing and I definitely feel it in my glutes. I almost pass out every single time I do it So we're gonna do that right now and then we're gonna finish off with some calf raises kind of where you meet with your trainer. I don't have one, so. They also have a sleeping room over there. I'm not gonna go in right now, but it's pretty cool. Okay, now I'm walking home. That was it. I always walk to and from the gym. I don't do cardio, because that's kind of my cardio moment. If I do do cardio at the gym, it'll probably be the Stairmaster. I like walking, you know, get some fresh air, but this is downtown, so it smells like shit. 
I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I don't know if I should end it here at home. I think I'm just gonna end it here. That was basically a week, weekend in my life as an influencer, a content creator, whatever you wanna call it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I don't really know how people do this because I don't watch anyone on YouTube. So like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys wanna see because I don't know how to do this. I don't know what you guys wanna see. I know you guys keep telling me to start YouTube, but I don't know what you guys wanna see. So did you like this vlog? Did you not? Literally let me know. I always take constructive criticism. Let me know. <laughs> and I hope you guys have a great one and I'll see you in the next one. Say to me.